So you're blind, you're a PC gamer, you have trouble seeing something. Sometimes it's text on the screen or you just need to zoom in to see some different icons, whatever. So this is a super quick video on how to use your magnifier when you're playing a game. So if you're playing a game in full screen mode, you'll notice that you can't zoom in, which sucks. You might have to take your phone out, zoom in, or if you have an electronic magnifier, you have to zoom in with that. Or you just get your super, super close to the screen. But if you play the game in windowed mode, you can zoom in and out just fine. On some games, I noticed that you can't. For example, in Sleeping Dogs, I wasn't able to zoom in. In Saints Row 4, I was able to zoom in but not zoom out. So sometimes it doesn't work, but if you're like me, I hate playing in windowed mode. Having the white toolbar at the top is really annoying. Now, if you're a gamer, you're saying, hey, there's borderless windowed mode, which looks exactly like full screen mode, but it's in a windowed mode, so you can zoom in and out. So it's essentially full screen mode with the ability to zoom in and out, which is true, but not all games have that. So here's a workaround. So here's Here's how you get borderless windowed mode on any game. That way you can zoom in and out and still feel like you're in full screen mode. First thing you're going to want to do is go to the link in the description. There you'll get to a download page where you can download borderless gaming. Scroll down. There you'll see borderless gaming exe in whatever version it is. Click on that to download it and then drag it to wherever you want whether it's your desktop, documents, whatever. Click yes and then go through the process of installing it. Whenever you launch Borderless, you'll get to this window that asks you if you want to go to the release page to see if there's any new updates. If you hit yes, it'll just take you to the website. You can just click no. On the left is a list of all applications that you have running right now. And on the right is a list of applications or games that you selected to automatically full screen when they launch. On the top left, you have options and tools, but I never use them. In the middle, you have an arrow pointing to the right, pointing to the left, a box with arrows pointing outwards, and a box with arrows pointing inwards. Click on the application you want to borderless full screen on the left, then click on the box with the arrows pointing outwards to full screen it. Now your application or game is full screened. To make sure that happens automatically, click on the game on the left and then click on the big right arrow and that will move it to your favorites list or your automatically full screen list. To move a game or app from the favorites, click on the arrow on the left. And then to put your game back into windowed mode, click on the box with the arrows pointing inwards. Here I have Tekken 7 in regular windowed mode. I'm gonna alt tab into borderless gaming. Click on the full screen button. See it's a super simple solution. Being able to full screen a game and being able to magnify it. Most games have a borderless window setting so you don't have to worry about it usually but for the occasional game that doesn't have it this is a perfect solution for that. Alright I'll see you in the next video.